Hi folks, this is Daily Spirit for Youth, a daily devotional that helps you grow closer to God and apply His Word to your life. Today's reading entitled Underestimated, written by Pastor Yosafat Simatupang, is based on 1 Peter chapter 2 verses 4 to 10. I will read verse 4. As you come to Him, the living stone, rejected by humans but chosen by God and precious to Him. Ah, people like him must be slow, forgetful, and we definitely won't move forward with him around. Have you ever heard a statement like that? Or even worse, such as, I don't think she deserves to be in our group. She will just be a problem. She is not on our level. It must be very painful when we were underestimated by others, especially for no clear reason. Something that is rejected or thrown away is something that is no longer useful or is broken. Jesus was likened to a living stone, but people around him did not like him. Jesus was often blasphemed, ridiculed, and even slandered. He was not only thrown away, but also put away, namely through crucifixion. However, someone who was despised by man was chosen by God to do great things. What man rejects, God uses to save the world. So nothing is too small to be useless before God. Folks, have you ever been underestimated by others or the crowd? How did you feel at that time? If we rely on human appreciation, we will easily be disappointed. Remember, even though people look down on us, we are still precious before God. We may even be more useful than the people who look down on us. What we need is steadfastness and complete surrender to God. So, don't be insecure or even discouraged if we are belittled by others. Instead, respond by proving ourselves through our achievements and good works. Ponder these questions. Who is meant by the living stone that has been rejected? How do we behave when we are underestimated by others? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below or you can comment on other people's thoughts. Now, let us pray. Dear Lord, give us the strength to face those who belittle us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, Please share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you. Sahabat, mari dukung pelayanan dan pekabaran Injil melalui YKB dengan membagikan link acara ini kepada sebanyak mungkin orang. Dukungan juga dapat saudara lakukan dengan mentransfer dukungan finansial ke rekening BCA ke nomor 450-305-2990, 450-305-2990 atas nama Yayasan Komunikasi Bersama.